Hello, fellow introverts, and welcome to Mist 3 Exile. I couldn't wait. I, I just could not wait, simply enough. I couldn't do it. And so here we are. I'm only, like, at a pay... I, I'm at, like, chapter 7 in the Book of Atreus, but I've decided that I am just going to read it while I play this, because why not? You know? Why not? Why not? I, I just want to keep going. I, I can't stop. I'm sorry if, if that offends anybody, but hopefully you guys are excited because I'm pretty excited. Now, that being said, I guarantee there's going to be some kind of problems that arise because this game is just as old as Riven, not just as old, ah, bah, bah, but it's, I, I guarantee I'll have the same problems. Now, the problem with this game is I can't alt tab at all, or it just freezes, and I've been looking everywhere and there's no workaround for that, and so if, it has that freezy, crashy bug that Riven had, then I am screwed because I can't do the same fix, because if I do the same fix, it will freeze the game in itself. So, let's pray. Let's pray. There's bound to be issues, but let's pray. We're going to jump right in. And I have come in here a couple times to... to, uh... just to see... So I do know the whole... I skip this every time, though. I haven't seen this. I realized as our group linked back to Dunny that we should not restore the city as we had planned. The once magnificent buildings lay in ruin, a testament to the hatred that had consumed them. Too many people had fallen victim to that hate. Oh, this is cool. prejudice and greed of which it sprang. Gazing out across the cavern, I decided to write another age. One that would help the Dunny survivors begin again, free from the tragedies of their past. So with my wife, Catherine, supporting me, I put aside that past to write a future. More than a year has gone by since I finished writing Blishon. I have a new daughter, who I hope will someday live to the age with me. And as I imagine Yisha meeting the Dunny, those brave men and women who are building a new life for themselves. I realize I've been given another chance as well. Oh, those are a chance sons. to learn from my oh. mistakes. And leave the past behind me, once and for all. Let's go, let's go, give me a puzzle. And now I'm playing. Yep, there's my little hand. Isn't it? Now, I'm curious as to where I am and who I am. It is pretty breathtaking, Catherine. We call it Tamana. Tamana. We moved here after Atrus finished writing Relation. He wanted us to have a new home too. I'm so glad to see you. I told Atrus our paths would cross again. He was just going to grab something for your trip to Relation, so he shouldn't be terribly long. Unless he decides to check over the whole house first, which means he could be hours resetting all his padlocks. Oh, great. But I know he was looking forward to introducing you to the Dunny, so he shouldn't be terribly long. This Why is... don't you wait in his study? This is so weird, because I'm reading the book right now, so I know, like... And that's my most recent and most insightful endeavor into the uh, into his character in general. But it's him as a child. So it's like now we're super far forward. And in my mind, I'm connecting the two. Because right now, he just got to Dani with his father again. By, they were traveling down into the earth. And I'm sorry if I'm spoiling anything, but... So I mean, like it's 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 a it's a shell shock switching to here, where now all that we've gone through, Mist and Riven, and now he has another. Like he's he I'm had sorry, kids. The other door. Yeah, I know which door. I had to try that though. He has kids now. He's got another kid, and he's got his wife. You know, this trip is exactly what Atrus needs right now. I haven't been able to get him out of the house for months, ever since he found his journals out of place. 
but seeing how well the Donny have settled in on Relishan should help him to finally relax. So, we must have found more Donny people. And now I look out on this and wonder if this was inspired by Atrus's home with his grandma at the volcano because it's very desert like and I and I had come into this area like I ch I tested out this game make sure it ran and everything before I started reading and then so now this whole time I've been reading I've been like just hoping that that was the case like we were back in his hometown because I really just want to go there but I, it doesn't seem like that's what's happening so that's a shame So this game feels very different already, but I like it already. I like how the motion works, how the controls feel, how it's all like, it, it's automatically moving around. It, I'm just looking around all the time. There's a book there. That's the book they were just talking about. That's where the Dani is apparently. Ooh, what's this? Is this ribbon? It's broken. Yeah, it won't let me in. Well, that's interesting, because since, since there's a minus magnifying glass, I know that I can't click on anything up here. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just... Ooh, that's just Catherine, his little, his little baby. Okay, new padlocks. Mm -hmm. I'm glad I went and played Mist. I'm very glad I played Mist because if not, I would have no idea who's like who these people are. <laughs> I wouldn't know what was going on. Like what? His his books got burned on Mist. Like what? His sons well, betrayed my friend, him. Oh, geez. so you found the Relishan book? He spooked me. Catherine tells me you've been here for some time. I'm sorry if I've kept you waiting. Since we'll be gone a few days, I need to secure some of my things. Look at you, Atrus. I also wanted to bring you this. It's a journal I kept while I was writing Relishan. I thought you might find it oh, interesting great. to read. Some uh, more reading. Compared to what the age truly is. Well, just let me get my keys to unlock Relishan and we'll be off. Oh, and I'm interested in hearing what you've been up to in recent months. Nothing. Oh, jeez, who are you? <laughs> what about the baby? <laughs> Where did that guy come from, exactly? Am I supposed to go in? Should I, uh... Alright. Looks like I'm going in. So my computer all tapped me already and it froze and I had to start over. So that sucks. Um, I gotta save a lot. <laughs> Gotta save a lot. Hopefully I can make it a seamless experience for you guys and hopefully nothing else just messed up because of it. What is this thing? Whoa. Oh, it's so riven. I should probably chase the guy, huh? curious how long this game is compared to the other ones. Mist was relatively short compared to uh, Riven. I'm curious about the puzzles in this game because it feels a lot more like Riven so I assume it's gonna be a lot harder. 
I'm already confused by these things. Ooh, what's this? I don't know what that is. Maybe I'm changing the magnification. Whoa, I'm pointing at the blue one now. So if I look forward, it looks at the left one. This is interesting. It's one of those uh, ashtrays outside of Walmart. No, I'm just kidding. It's obviously another one of those pods. I guess we're gonna keep on exploring, because I don't know what I'm doing. I don't really have an objective other than f figure out a way to get into that thing, whatever that is. I guess we'll go down here. It's a pretty big, uh, what was that? Whistling rock, huh? I see. That's cool, it tells me things. Okay, I'm glad that I can I have 360 look around capability. Although I'm guaranteed to miss something because of it. Alright, what have we got in here? Just a lever. That's it. Okay. I have no idea what I'm doing, this is awesome. Okay. That's cool, doing things all over the place. I haven't seen any people yet other than... That's creepy. Other than the, uh... Mr. Man up in the, the place with the thing. Ooh, a book. It's just a leaf. Reading... You guys can read through that real quick. You just pause on each page. And I will go through and read it myself. I figured this is a happy medium. You guys could just pause the video. And, but I should still show you, like, so that just in case the people who haven't played can uh, take the time to read through there. What the heck did I just do? This is creepy. Okay. Why'd you fly back in there, stupid little fly? What does that do? Creates a wind tunnel of some kind. Two, when added to electricity. Alright. I'm sure these are teaching me some kind of concepts. Give me the hammer. Alright, I guess we're done here. Um, what's behind here? A door. An elevator? Oh my gosh, there's so much being thrown at me again. It's missed all over again with the amount of information they're throwing at me. Now what? OK, 
Okay, there is an elevator. Does that mean I'm going up into the room with the guy? This is, this is crazy. It's pretty cool though. Yep, there he is. Who are you? Adrian? Is that you? No. Come to rescue your book so soon? So I'm not on... Not yet, old friend. I'm not on Relish or whatever the heck. I'm not on that new age in, that was locked in the cage. Not yet, anyway. Okay, what did that do? I still can't play, I'm still just sitting here. Oh wait, I can play now. I didn't mean it. Can I skip? I can. Just let me pull the lever again, dang it. Wasted. Pretty efficiently, too. An efficient waste of time. Alright, so what I'm gonna do... Go back on down. Hop back on out. I wonder what this age is called, then. Because I'm definitely in some other weird age, not... I'm not in the one that uh, I thought I was going to be going into. Whoa, I didn't even see those. Okay, so let's get out of here and go explore elsewhere. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold the phone. What's this way? It's just the other side. It's like a shortcut through. This is very mysterious. Yeah, so I went up in there. Oh, hey! What the heck, little guy? How you doing? Listen to the noise, though. Chirps. Hey, little squee chirp. do with him? Can I even get to him? I don't know. Okay, so we got a squeech here. Oops. Oh, there's the ladder. I was looking for that. Oops. What's that? I'm a little disoriented. What the heck? So I pointed it at the squee chirps and I clicked. And then that happened. Should I go back down to it now? 
I'm so confused. I mean, I'm just so intrigued by what is happening here. Because it's nothing that I've ever seen in these games. So they like grow bigger towards the squee chirps. <laughs> or something. <gasps> I can walk across that. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, I can. But all right, guess what? I'm gonna make these episodes a little shorter this time around just because I wanna put out a larger quantity of them. And so I think that if I upload more frequently but make the episodes a little shorter, it'll be less frustration for me and it'll be more content for you. And it will be good content rather than me droning on for 30 minutes. So, I mean, I, that is what I just did for 20 minutes, but whatever, it was great. This is a great time already. I I love it. I can't wait. It's so it feels so much like Riven, but there's so much extra mystery that I don't even understand. And then now I have these new insights of the Book of Atris, and it's just gonna be a great time. Now, like I said, expect some kind of mess ups here and there. Expect me getting frustrated at it crashing because I really don't know how to fix that right now. But I'm gonna do my best to make it a seamless experience for you guys. I'm going. I think I'm going to uh, stray away from the schedule and just kind of post when, I, when I'm when i ready to, and I think I'm going to be posting more frequently so you don't really have to worry about it, but maybe not necessarily worry about the Monday, Wednesday, Friday, just kind of check. Click, click the little bell next to the subscribe button and you'll be notified when I post because I have been posting pretty sporadically, but I, I intend on posting more frequently. I do. So. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And get ready, because this is going to be a whole nother journey yet again. I'm excited. I hope you are. And thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.